hi guys welcome to my youtube channel if you've not subscribed to my youtube channel i don't know what you're waiting for quickly mm, click on that subscribe button because you'll be getting health wellness and beauty tips here and of course if you're a woman and you want to own and control your body this is the best platform or let's say this is the best channel for you so you've seen on the thumbnail already what we're talking about and we're talking about the glycolic acid toner first off i'd like us to know that glycolic acid is an exfoliating acid most people like to use lactic acid in place of glycolic acid but i personally like to use glycolic acid in the place of lactic acid because i feel glycolic acid is more effective and it gives faster results than lactic acid and i also feel this more powerful than lactic acid now this is my personal opinion it means someone else might prefer lactic acid and come to say lactic acid is more effective than glycolic acid so today i will be talking about glycolic acid and why you should pick this product i'll also be talking about the disadvantages of the products as well so if you want to use it there are some measures you need to keep in place before you decide to use this product or before you um start using this product so for this particular product um it can actually be used to treat hyperpigmentation remember that on it the root glycolic seven seven percent i almost said 70. so part of the reasons why um skincare industries make you know the percentage of the products or of the ingredients they use in their production is for you to take caution know it's effective and know how to use it appropriately and correctly so this particular product if you've suffered from hyperpigmentation over the years or oh i saw a lady on tiktok talking about how she used this product after her three weeks orientation camp that she has seen a whole lot of shaggy and plenty of stuff that's happened to her skin so she used this product after a short while she regained her skin so she forgot to tell you guys that the fact that this product contains um seven percent glycolic acid is not a product that you use and go under the sun because if you do that, you're definitely going to roast your skin. Some products are just best used at night, regardless of how you want to use your SPF. Because if they are telling you to reapply your SPF after every two hours, some of you might not listen to that. Some of you might not really want to put in the effort to do that. Or if they're telling you, okay, before you use your sunblock after every two, two hours, you have to like wash your face again before you even apply the sunblock. It sounds like a whole lot of work and most of you don't want to venture into that so to avoid all other types of repercussion and to avoid a lot of problems all you have to do is just use the product at night to save a lot of stories also people have said that this product works for dark inner thighs dark under arm that i cannot guarantee but since a whole lot of people have said it i feel like when a product is effective and people come out to talk about it is because they are interested in the product and because the product has worked for them they want other people to try it out so most likely if you have dark underarm and you intend to lighten it up or you have dark inner thighs then maybe you should check out those products if it worked for you because it has worked for a whole lot of people but if you're using this product on your skin like externally please avoid the sun as much as you can glycolic acid is no baby joke and it's very effective yes but don't put yourself at risk by roasting your skin yourself these are products that you apply and not go under the sun if it was like two percent glycolic acid then you can apply it and then use your sunscreen repeatedly after every two to three hours and let's just assume that you forget would know that your skin is not at so much risk but using seven percent and not applying sunscreen is a very big risk you don't want to take if you find it really interesting you can like and share and if you want me to talk about any other product please let me know in the comment section bye